in one in twenty five with vision here. What do you got under that? Is that the regular cover A? Yes. Yeah, a cover. That's what you grab every week, right? The Avengers and Scarlet Witch. Right. And then I really like that one. Nice cover set there. Yeah. Cover A, B, and the one in twenty five. Is that all you're grabbing this week? Uh, I'm gonna grab Scarlet Witch too. <laughs> this one right here is really nice. The negative space. Yes. With the dress. Yeah. And you got issue ten. There's the variant, and then the one in twenty five is twenty eight bucks. That's really nice. Hope you guys are having a great new comic book day, though. Everybody already went pretty crazy buying all their stuff, so some of the books are missing from the wall. But you can see over here is a bunch of these 30th anniversary specials. Did you grab all of them? Four different cards. I only got three of the four. The one that I'm missing is the cyborg. You need the blue one. The blue one is a cyborg, so I'll get that one. You know what's funny? I never worry. So you know what's funny, man. I never worry. I have my contacts. So you got your contacts? Yep, I have my contacts. I'll be calling one now in a couple minutes. So <laughs> you really want it? How bad do you want it? <laughs> Pretty bad if I can get a nice copy. Pretty bad if you can get a nice copy. Yep. Super mm -hmm. girl special. What if I give you that one? <laughs> you want that? Yeah, I'll take it. There, there you go. Bro. That's what you're looking for, right? Yeah. There you go. Hey, I'll return a favor. Don't forget. I'll yeah, man. I'll, one for when you, you get so. something, yeah. <laughs> I always do. So you know me. So. All right. See, so here we go. So you can show. Look, if you're showing that, look. Let's show your fans the book covers. We'll have to tell them. This is a spoiler. Spoiler alert. Cyborg spoiler by Jiang. Oh, that's sick. That's Are the all blue them like one. that? Yeah, they're all like this, cool. but there's four different artists. Let's go to the other ones now. Hold on. We're going to skip these because these are the other books for this week. Here we go. Green cover. Spoiler number two. Eradicator. That's cool. Which cover do you like the best, do you know? Well, What's up? Now. Good morning, everybody. Oh, let me get a live chat up. Yep. Hope you guys have Black. a great day. Superboy oh, by cool. Francis J. Monopool. And, of course, the final one in red. <laughs> oh, Steel, that's Steel, yep, right? Yep, Steel. Mm -hmm. That's sick. With, uh, I don't know who the artist is, after Bogdanov. And Very then, of cool. course, the wraparound, this side where Jurgen's breeding. Those are big books. And that's it. So that's the wraparound regular. And then, big of DC course, you week. have the flow, which should still be up there. There's grabs. I got a... Yeah. And then, of course, like I said, to continue, three of the covers of this one. Is that this Adam is, Hughes? Oh, yeah, it is Yeah, Adam that's Hughes. a Hughes cover. Yeah, right. Yeah, you got X23. And then, of course, um, Kendrick Lim for Catwoman for the Scorched Earth conclusion. Mm. Oh, I'm sorry, bud. You're good. Yep. And of course, you got the You Jorge didn't want to get the foil minions. one? The foil is pretty nice. Now, I, I usually it's don't get cool. too many foil covers mm. when I usually get the regular ones. What's going on, everybody? Good morning. Yeah, oh, is that Destiny. the Will Jack? Yeah, that one's that's nice. Po well, that's Pomp Man. Then good Will morning, Jack. everyone. Of course, on Super Bowl, and then I think X. I have the other one down here, which is the Frank Cho. Nice stack of books. Big week today, yeah. huh? Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. And then, of course, I got three of the X-Men covers, which I had to get. The first one feeling, dealing with Firestar versus Juggernaut, continuing that storyline. This is Acme Superstore. And then this is the Blood Red Cyclops. I was looking for the variant of this. They didn't have it. Yeah, that's, the, that's not the virgin. And then, of course, this is the wraparound variant for the X-Men 60th anniversary that they did for the other artist. Oh, that's cool, yeah. Yep. So I was like, yeah, I had to pick that one up. So. This crap, man. Oh, yeah. No, oh, it was good. It, like I said, it was, a, it was a pretty... It's another hefty week for me this week, but now i got to select which of the best... Yeah, <laughs> there you today. go, right? Those are through. You're doing great. Looking at the uh, beginning of the new comic book wall. Alice Cooper. I don't think anybody grabbed any of these there's only one book it looks like so low print run heads up you're starting to freeze uh oh am i freezing hopefully not we just started the stream <laughs> so if we're if we're looking a little laggy let me know i could restart it snyder is this a new snyder book canary number one from dark horse there's a couple different covers well there's a lot of covers actually I just realized you got, it looks like a virgin cover right here. This is the new number one. A one in 10. And then the one in 25. What's underneath here? I have no idea what this is about. Looks like the earth is splitting apart. Yeah, happy Spider Boy Day. I was actually thinking of uh, renaming the stream to Hunting for Spider Boy. <laughs> but it seems like Superman was the hot one this week. Everybody was running to Superman. 
I'm happy I was able to get him that blue one he was looking for. What is this? Bombshell and Tom Tom. Issue number two. You gonna grab one? I'm not, I don't know. I don't, I'm not familiar with it. So. Yeah, it looks interesting. Canary. Look at this gargoyles cover. That's a pretty cool one there. One in ten for sixteen bucks. Then you got the Virgin action figure cover. Do you know who Alice Cooper is? Yeah, Alice Cooper is the musician, right? Yeah. <laughs> what is this? Ghost Lore? Issue number six on Ghost Lore. Here's the one in ten. I thought it was breaking last second, but it looks like hands. Marvel Gods. Is that a second print? I think that's a second print. Oh, yeah, right there. Oh, that's nice. That's the first time I've ever seen when they do the second print with that, in the red. Because usually it's hard to see. They do it in black. So that's really, uh, you know, that's good. I like that. Angelo. Yep. Another Avengers cover with callback to us. Oh, yeah. Avengers. This one's really cool, too, because this is the uh, the Moon Knight Night's End variant, and they've been doing a bunch of these. I think there's a couple of them today, too, with, like, Moon Knight. I, there's one. There's a really cool one with Gambit on the wall over there where he's, like, fighting Gambit. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Is this... What Godzilla is this? Is this number one? Godzilla. Here there be dragons. Wow, that's cool. Issue number five. Tell me that doesn't look like the scene from The Hobbit. That's sick. Fifteen bucks. That's a cool cover, though. Issue number five. What do we got up here? Almost Dead from a Blaze. Issue number one. You have the one in ten virgin. The one in twenty black and white. Still haven't gotten gods yet. Yeah, I grabbed it the first print when Scotty Young did the cover. This is the new uh, Aquaman. So this is based off the new movie coming out. You have the Jason Momoa photo cover. I might grab one of these, I'm thinking, like a sketch cover. I don't have any Aquaman sketch covers. And then there's the one in 25. You got Black Manta on the cover. <clears throat> Avengers issue 7. There's that Moon Knight cover. West Coast Avengers. Captain America. See, this is this how they usually do the second print in black. I can't really see it too good. Issue number one, second print. Charm City. Oh, what is this? Is this Charm City? Or, that looks like Conan a little bit. It is Conan. I didn't notice that. Conan. That's cool. Virgin variant on Conan. I'm gonna grab that. Oh, they're all kind of dinged up though. Poison Ivy came out today. I didn't know Poison Ivy came out. I think I'm gonna grab this right here. It was a really good story, but essentially, love Conan. But that's that's the gist. Play right over there. For whatever reason, Charm City's really good. I haven't checked it out yet. What do we got over here? A Haunting on Mars number one from Scout. Happy Astronaut number two. Uh, I mean, Grim uh, fairy tales. I know, Look at this one. Like Ten bucks. Xenoscope. Wow, that one's actually really nice. For a second, it looked like J. Scott Campbell. That's a pretty sick cover. I don't know. Oh, sorry. Almost dropped it. She's got like a little sugar skull face. What do you guys think? Is that a $10 grab or what? That's nice. Yeah. Only one here. This is interesting, also. Tale of the Batman Gotham by Gaslight. This is the New York Comic Con print, though. Like the uh, limited printing. 25 bucks. Mike Mignola cover. Batman Catwoman number one. Flow. Yeah, Xenoscope does a great job. Hello from New York. Good morning, everybody. Don't forget to comment down below what your top pickup is this week. Dr. Strange. It's a nice Clea cover. You have the 1 in 25, David Mack. Heat Seeker. This one's nice here. Oh, really nice cover. Oh, this one. Holiday Faceless and Family Number One. Only press. 
Mm -mm. One in twenty-five for nineteen dollars. This is over here. Just Jeff. Oh, Jeff is the other one too. That wasn't super popular this week. Yeah, there's three covers in that one. Yeah, here's cover A. You got Black Cat. I don't know anything about it specifically. Couple different variant covers on Faceless and Family. Detective Comics. This Detective one in twenty five with Azrael. I like that they did all. Honestly, what got me is they did the homages for the last Rust and the Lost Boys. That was interesting. One in twenty five. What is that book about? This this one here. Well, all right, let's look up a solicitor. <laughs> there you go. So maybe we can see the best. All I know is what my wife said. Yeah. This looked interesting, the canary one. A lot of number ones coming out. So this book. Yeah, there is Moon Knight. Stops. Shops could order as many of this as you want for free. The variants cost you, but not the A cover, because the solicit said we believe in it so much that we think your patrons will buy it. <laughs> so shops can have A covers for number one for free. Wow. Excellent. That's how much that's how much they believed in the solicit. Can't go wrong with that thing. It's a five dollar book for you. Because I'm special. No, look. Shops. Like I can order the book for free. Oh, really? I don't pay for this one like I do oh, all the other comics, is what I'm trying to tell you. Oh, that's cool. So it's it's like uh, you, see you don't it, something for the comic shop, right? <laughs> I, was, I wasn't trying to be funny. <laughs> that's, that's good. You have right. to try harder. <laughs> this is like a little video game homage here, I guess, right? The PlayStation right. cover. Blood mini series premiere. Living in an isolated life in a shadowed valley, surrounded by mountains and a thick forest, the father and son are terrorized by a dangerous supernatural presence. Only the father's dark secrets can save them, or damn their souls for all eternity. No, oh, boy. Being a single father can be tough, but for Ezra Connolly, it's a duty he do doesn't take lightly. Like he's a duty freak. Living off grid. Away from prying eyes in the heart of forest country, he spends his days teaching his teenage son Will survival skills. Yeah. But Will the last of us. Yeah. The last of us. Questions Ezra fears to answer about his past and about why they never leave the. Oh, that is Lost Sunday. Boys. I didn't realize that's yeah. the Lost Boys cover. Uh, Someone just commented. Uh, <laughs> what is Jeff? Jeff is the shark, right? Yeah. yeah. Jeff is the shark. Yeah. What do you mean, what's Jeff? Yeah. What's Jeff? What's <laughs> Someone Jeff? commented, what's Jeff? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Jeff's got a couple covers out this week. And one of them, he's dreaming of being worthy. Is that what that is? Is yeah, that a dream? That's, that's funny. And look, he's got a little Thor action figure. <laughs> that, that, that was a pop. Look at the seat cover, Angel. He's got a little Thor action figure he was playing with. Oh, I just realized that. Yeah, that's funny. that was a pop. That is cute. The Catwoman one's cool, too. Oh, so it's about the vampires. Oh, Magneto. That's what, it says, unless you to be a what is this right here? A 1 in 10. Maybe some new character design? Masters of the Universe, Forge of Destiny. No. Ooh, what is this one over here? This one's interesting. Not a variant, it's just a regular cover B. Gargoyles. There's cover A. Beast of Bauer Boulevard. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna grab this cone in here. Um, was that mine? I don't know. I'm just. I don't think that was mine. No, I'm definitely grabbing this. This is cool. Didn't realize it's cone. This is A. Yeah. And I think we got gargoyles. Yeah, here's a one in seven. What's up? Oh, so <laughs> All right, so that's it for over here. At gargoyles, you gotta love how they do the variant covers. It's like six bucks for the virgin variant. If you're into gargoyles. All right, let's see what else we got. This is a, a lot of stuff this week. I like All right, now we're on wall number two. <laughs> Let's see, um, Midnight Show. Looks like there's a lot of low print run stuff this week. Everything's got like one book on the shelf. Is that what that is? That's what I was saying too. Makes me want to grab it. <laughs> I might take that home. One in seven. That's pretty cool. I also like this one here. I have no idea who the artist is. That's nice. Xenoscope. Yeah. Is that Ivan Tao? That's cool. Oh, I didn't see that. Every month they do special retailer covers. 
that you can order. This is the bronze. That's pretty cool. What else is over here? My Little Pony. My Little Pony, I swear, is like the only... My Little Pony? <laughs> the only kid book every single week that's on the shelf. Hello from the Philippines. What's going on? Love both Gargoyles books. Haven't been checking out Gargoyles. Do you read or do you just buy and bag? I do a lot of my uh, my readings on like the number ones. I usually don't grab number two or anything unless it's something I I really enjoy. Like Predator Wolverine was pretty good. The new Hulk that came out, I ended up reading that too. That wasn't super crazy good. But a lot of times I'll end up just um like listening. I, I follow a couple people on YouTube that do like audio replays of the comics and stuff. I would give him a shout out. I forgot his channel name, but the guy's like really big. That's He's got... the one we were talking about where they, it was open this order one? on A cover for shops for free. Oh, so this the is the one you had to pay for. So these are, this is just an E cover, but each variant as you went up, like the B cover was five, was oh. $7. The C cover oh, was $10. But the A cost a shop zero. So, hey, take a risk on this because we believe in it. Well, there you go. Vault's out here just trying to get stuff out there, it looks like. <laughs> Is that a number one? Oh, two. Was, number two. Mini, it's, I think it's, it's a four. Dan's Kai. Four issue limited series. There's a one in ten right there. Yeah. Second print on Transformers. I have not seen the second print on Transformers yet. I haven't really checked it out. It's over there. There's a few of them. <laughs> My Little Pony. What is that? Stranger Things and... Oh, we haven't checked out Star Wars. Look at that. 1 in 25. That's pretty nice. You got Hyperspace Stories, issue 10. And Stranger Things. 1 through 4. Another limited series. I'm not sure when the new, uh, new one's coming out. What is this? Okay, cool. Street Fighter Omega. The thank you variant for twenty bucks. I have no idea who char what character that is. Bumblebee. Oh, spoiler! But someone said Bumblebee is dead. I don't know. The new Transformers. Saint Seiya. Knights of the Zodiac. I'm not sure what that is. Vampirella. I'll understand it. I'll understand it. It's a nice one there. Yeah, that's all it is. Perillo cover. That's it. You got her sitting on the skull. And then all the different ratio variants. It's an anime, right? Yeah, I think someone was saying it was based off of uh, like Sailor Moon or something, right? I don't know if they do it now because they switch a bunch of stuff. But I think this one's pretty cool here. Oh, what's going on, JJ? Good morning, man. Appreciate you. As always, I always appreciate everybody hanging out. This one is cool, man. How much is this? See, I think they should do something about. Hey, Larry. Do you have a? Is this this isn't cover price, right? Oh uh, yeah, it is. That's cover price. I'll do that for you. Oh yeah. Ha -ha. <laughs> Asking you shall receive. They have the regular cover. Very cool. Should be over Sorry, guys. Uh, I did see. It. No, I did All see right, what else I we got? Twenty Jeff because some people in the store love it. Hey man, did, did you grab a Jeff? Did you grab a Jeff? Uh, I didn't want all three. Excuse me, sir. Do you have a moment to talk about Jeff? Jeff. <laughs> I didn't grab one. Should I grab one? Yes. I didn't want it. And then Super I girl. Them, I put them all three on the. Well, I don't know, Angelo. Like, did you see the number ones now? Thirty-five dollar book. Jeff, Ooh. I. We all have it. Yeah. What's up, man? What's up, bro? <laughs> I'm missing the uh, West up, Coast bro? Avengers, though. That's the I one I need. His Jeff first appearance. Of the, of Supergirl the special? Oh, Jeff's first appearance. Yeah, it's the West Coast Avengers one, right? Volume 3, number 7. There you go. I love how you know exactly what it is. It's like your favorite character, huh? Yes, he is. He's a baby. He must protect him. Yeah, you got to put him in the top loaders. Look at this book this week, though. This is one of the top covers. Sensational She-Hulk, Adam Hughes, foil cover. That was a short from last week. Yeah, you were supposed to get it last week. Didn't come in. I grabbed a couple of those. This is a big week. Snow White, Zombie Apocalypse. Issue number four. I don't even know issue number one came out. If you like Abraham Lincoln Vampire Hunter, that's a good book. Oh, I did enjoy that movie. It was a good one. It's the same idea. Man, these photo covers are really nice, too. Ask if usage still the same as from back then. Not sure what that means. Second appearance of Black Widow as as Toxin. Oh, that is the Black Widow, um, like Venom, right? I forgot about Toxin. that. 
I grabbed one, but I forgot what it was. <laughs> I just it's, like it's, the cover. It's a team-up book in there, and she's about to lead the Thunderbolts. Oh, that's pretty cool. What is this, a 1 in 100? Yeah. 98 bucks. Sorry, bud. This one is another one of those Moon Knight covers. And there's cover A. This is where the Superman was. As you can see, Superman was the top pick this week. Looks like that was the hot book. Mm, King Spawn. Issue 27. And then there's the Sam and Twitch cover. Ranger Academy, number one. From Boom. No one. Night of the Living Dead. Hmm. Jeff's over, on, over there, I think. Yeah, Jeff's all the way over there. Here's Spider Boy too. Yes, yeah, Spider Boy. It's the problem is which cover do you get without having to get all of them? This is definitely the most popular one, I would say. The negative space. Not the David Aha. There's one of these left. Do you have a limit on these? Two. Two per person. I'm gonna grab one more. This is cool. Foil cover. That's David Aha. He did all the art in that Hawkeye run. I know, but it's why. It's why do they gotta do a one in? It's such, it's such pretty work. Well, I think I the second print is that cover. It's a simple cover, but it's cool. He's a minimalist. That's All of his style is like minimalism. You know, the Scotty cover is a must-grab, though, too. I like how he did it all upside down like that. That's cool. Yeah, I forgot that AHA did that um, puck I run. Traveling to Mars, issue 9. Oh, and then Transformers. Issue number one. This is the second print on issue number one. What else we got over here? The Autobots and Decepticon cover. Spider Boy. Yeah, I guess. ASM homage. Oh, it's nice. Oh. Red light. I like Tank I don't like all his stuff, but sometimes he's savage. Alright, I'll get one in. Rare flavors. This red light cover is cool. Right here. You know me. Every time I see a redhead on the cover, it's like an obligation to buy it. <laughs> Always get the second print. You guys think I should pick up the Transformers second print? This is a pretty sick cover. I, I will admit that one's pretty cool. With Optimus. The problem is a lot of them got little like uh, I don't know what you can see. There's like color rub on all of them. I think that's why they're all sitting here still. What else is down here? Walking Dead, White Widow, number one. There was the Adam Hughes, one in 25. Spider Boy, Savage Red Sonya, number one. These are nice covers, too. You got the blank. Oh, look at these art Adams. I didn't notice these at first. I grabbed the regular Art Adams, but maybe I'll put it back and grab this one right here. This red one is sick. What is this, a 1 in 10? Art Adams? And then the black one is 11 bucks. But this red one is cool, man. I'll grab that. The Virgin on the cosplay cover? What is that? The Ribbon Queen. Star Wars... Dark droids. There might have been something this week. Price on Sam and Twitch. Uh, it should be cover price. Usually, um, yeah, I don't think there's any upcharge on them. And these are cheap, too. Image usually does them at, like, what, like, three bucks or something? Oh, there it is, yeah. Two ninety nine. Oh, victory. This is a nice one here. A photo variant on Victory. Try to get it without the glare a little bit. One in seven. Um, then I think that's pretty much it besides Thor. So you have the one in 100. Yeah, that's a heavy week. Lots of cool new stuff. This cover is pretty awesome. One in 50 on Thor. Ultimate Universe. 
If I was going to pick a book that would be a good read for this week, it'd probably be this one. I might grab this. I'll show you guys my stack I ended up grabbing, but here's the new number one. This one's cool, too. Looks like you got Dr. Doom in the back over there. And Dr. Afra. Here's the Moon Knight vs. Gambit cover. Comment down below who wins that fight. Moon Knight vs. Gambit. Probably, uh, I'd say Moon Knight. You have the Cyclops cover. This one is really cool. There's a, I think it's a 1 in 25 that came out, or it might be a 1 in 50. They didn't get it in, but that one's really cool. It's like a virgin, right? And then you got the Juggernaut. Oh, this is actually sick. I just realized it's kind of like a trading card. That's cool. That's actually really cool. Oh, look at that. And then it has the stats on the back. Oh, so it's just like a giant trading card. Oh, do I? Oh, my gosh. I think I have to grab this. That's sick. I'll put it back. I got a big stack this week, but that's a cool one. <laughs> All right. I think it's pretty much it. Let's grab our top loaders over here. And then let's go through our books for this week. Pretty busy one. Make sure we're not missing anything. We got the, the Godzilla down there with the smog, but... And then that one too. That one's pretty cool. This one over here. Let's see what we got this week. This is such a cool candy trade too. I love that. All right, so I got this, which is pretty sick. Vampirella sitting on top of the uh, the skull there. Got Conan. This is issue number three. The variant cover. Or is this a second print? It's a second print, I think. <laughs> Savage Red Sonia, Art Adams, 1 in 10. I got Spider Boy, the foil cover. Yeah, this one is really nice here, this foil cover. I'm gonna grab that. Spider Boy. You know me, I gotta grab two of the Scotty Spider Boys. I got two of these. Try to find the nicest ones I could. Cover A. Marvels is coming out. You guys gonna check that out? And then Aquaman's coming out soon too. Venom. I'm gonna grab this one. I just like the cover. I didn't really have any idea about the key. How is the movie of Conan? There's a couple different movies. The classics are obviously the best, but um. There was a modern one that came out with Jason Momoa a little while ago. I think I'm going to put this one back. I didn't realize they had that one in ten. And then this is a nice grab. I was able to pick this up. They only had one copy. Did you see X-Men 28 Cyclops cover? Yes, I did. We actually just checked that out. I was looking for the Virgin variant. And then I grabbed two of these. So, not a, I mean, it's a heavy week, but it's some incentives and some cool books. Put that with that. Let's just a lot of stuff. What's going on, everybody? Hope you all are having a wonderful day too. We got some awesome videos coming out this Friday. Is actually, I'm pretty sure, the final video from the Daytona Con. Then we got a bunch of more videos coming out. Oh, actually, we just hit. I think we hit fifteen thousand. Um, let me put this back on the wall. But I think we hit fifteen thousand followers too on YouTube. I just want to say thank you and welcome to all the new. Uh, all the new followers and subscribers. Where does this go? <laughs> Let's put this over here. That's just for international Japanese. I don't think I got too many Japanese people that watch. But it's probably. What time is it in Japan right now? Anybody from Japan that watches? <laughs> Natasha's sister. Oh, is it? I didn't know that. Yeah, I thought White Widow was like an indie title, but um. It was. And they turned it into, they did Marvel, right? Oh, they're doing, they're doing Marvel with it. Yeah, I saw your dad, Jackson. He's just over here, yeah. He's all over the place. I love, I love your dad, man. Good guy. All right, let's see if I'm missing anything. Shout out, Mr. Harley. Yeah, right. Mr. Harley, shout out. A.K.A. Jackson's dad. Yeah. All right, let's check out some of these. Sometimes there's some cool back issues. Missing stuff. Ooh, what is this one? Design variant. Some Wonder Woman. So how's everybody doing today? Did you guys have a wonderful Halloween? Everybody's safe. Hand out some candy. We don't get no trick-or-treaters by us. 
unfortunately. It's very boring on Halloween. <laughs> Anything over here, some more Red Sonia. Doo -doo -doo. Yes, the Brandon Comic Fanfare did go on, right? I know there's also a convention going on in, uh, I think it's Dallas, Texas. It's a collector's summit I heard about. And a couple people I know are going to be going. I kind of wish I would have knew about it a little earlier. I probably would have went. But um, I don't know. I got to start going to more events for sure and giving you guys some content at other conventions and stuff. We'd love to head out to California for that convention. But uh, focusing on the house sale we got coming up in December. And then we got Thrifting Comics on the 11th of this month. So December 2nd is our house sale. The 11th of this month is the Thrifting Comics sale. And then, uh, yeah, pretty much it. I'm just looking right now at the back issue section, guys, and then we're going to get out of here. What is that up there? The, the zombie? I think that's what that zombie tramp, I think. Oh, yeah, the bear with the bloody bag. That's a fun one. <laughs> all right, everybody. Well, I hope you all had a wonderful day. I hope you enjoy the new video tomorrow. It's the final wrap-up at DaytonaCon. And we got videos coming out every Monday and Friday, live streams every Wednesday. And we'll see you guys next week, all right? Take care and comment down below what your top Jackson, pick was this week.